All right, guys, during an Instagram Live session, Dwight Howard did his best Shannon imitation that included calling Lakers in seven. All right, all right. Skip. Uh, that was good. Shannon, how much did you like this impression? I liked it a lot. It showed Dwight watching the show, Skip. Yeah, <laughs> that's true. But you noticed when AD and LeBron came by and he said, Skip, they look for that smoke. Yeah. They're like, hey, uh, oh, you thought I was, he said, you thought I was talking to Skip for real? And he's like, yeah, I yeah. did. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Yeah. No. They know what's up, Skip mm -hmm. Baylor. <laughs> Everybody getting in on uh, cracking jokes at old Shadow's expense, huh? Yep. I see right now. Mm -hmm. But I like it. I don't have a problem with that, Skip. And uh, I think the thing is now is that I get that a lot. Everywhere I go, everybody says Skip. That's, that's, that's what he referred to me as a Skip. But it just showed, Skip, they're close. They're a close team. You look at it, they're having a good time. I'll buy uh, that. Uh, uh, Mm -hmm. And they're having a good time in the bubble. They don't need to go outside the bubble to have a good time like the team that you thought was going to represent mm -hmm. the Western Conference mm -hmm. and the NBA Finals. Yeah, and we I, got bubble trouble. Yeah, y'all in trouble. Mm -hmm. I, I love this, Kevin. Mm -hmm. I love it. Good job, Dwight. Mm -hmm. So, as much as I love that he was giving us a little free publicity, <laughs> I did not think it was a great Shannon Sharp. <laughs> I called it Dwight Sharp, but I did that with quotes around it because he was trying to be Dwight Sharp, and it didn't come off nearly as as great as say Jamie Fox. Jamie, yeah. Hey, Jamie Fox was <laughs> bullseye dead on. Yes. Thank you very much. Game over. Yes. Right. Yes. And I also don't think LeBron was real impressed that Dwight was doing what whatever he's doing. IG, IG live. live. I guess he was. And, and it looks like it's in kind of the locker room, right? Is it, it is. It, right? Right. Uh, didn't it look like they were coming in yes. from practice mm -hmm. or maybe from lifting weights or coming something? Coming from practice or ending practice or something. Yep, right? Okay, so think about this. Dwight is, let's let's give it, in the locker room, and he's got his, his camera stand set up, right. maybe in his locker, right. and he's going IG Live, and he's doing his impression of Undisputed right after practice because they're walking in like right. they just got finished, right? right? yeah. Okay, LeBron took one look and walked, you know, he said, I, enough yeah. of that. Okay, I don't know that, that LeBron would have loved him doing that in the locker room. Don't you think it's a little weird that Dwight would be going IG live? Remember once upon a time what Antonio Brown right. did after a game in Kansas City? Not quite the same magnitude right. or, or circumstance because they had just won a playoff game. Right. And unfortunately, uh, the coach was speaking to the team in mm -hmm. private, and mm -hmm. you know the rest of the story. Right. He took a shot at New England, and then they had to go up to New England and get their butts kicked the next week. Right. Okay, so to me, I think LeBron is all in, all business in the bubble. Absolutely. And I think he would look sideways at Dwight as much as he enjoys Dwight and, and his happy-go-lucky spirit mm -hmm. that he brings to the team. And Dwight has played very well. Yeah. He's been a very valuable off-the-bench backup center for this team. Played valuable minutes, mm -hmm. set valuable picks. He's mm -hmm. done a lot of valuable things for this team. Right. He is still a presence and a force. Right. What has been the one knock on Dwight Howard his whole career. He, take it seriously. he just doesn't take it seriously <laughs> enough because what happened his first go round in LA, he starts coming out before games shooting hook shots from half court and there was a four with a backpack on. Yeah, with a backpack <laughs> on. And there was a, a a legendary Laker who was the team leader at that time mm -mm. and he said no. Right. And he was all over Dwight Howard, and pretty soon he wanted Dwight Howard gone right. from Los Angeles. Mm -hmm. And I'm talking about the late, great Kobe Bryant, right. obviously. And Dwight soon wound up with the Houston Rockets, and then he was sent packing again, and we know he bounced from all Atlanta around. to Charlotte right. And to here Memphis. he is, and he's at the right place at the right time. But I think LeBron is like, come on, Dwight. You have to go straight in the locker room and go IG live. It's it. That's that's not how you stay a hundred percent committed. At least go back to your room and do. No, it. he ain't want he ain't want Dwight talking to you. No, because he know that you have been very very derogatory. I have not. I've yeah. been honest. No, you ain't been honest. I've said, you ain't been honest. I said a lot of good things and a lot of not so good no. things about LeBron James. Wait. Somebody on this show has to be honest about goat. LeBron. If you say yes. goatish, yeah, it would have no problem. Goatish, but it, yeah, he's yeah. a goat. Yeah, well, he is the goat of games, as in he's the reason they lose some no, games. No, 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 don't do that. Don't do that. But the point is, 
are, are you okay with Dwight doing IG live in the locker room right after a practice in the bubble? I'm I, not. Well, I'm sure. I know. I know. I, I, I just think the locker room would normally it's be. It's like off. a sacred place. You, yeah, you but, but, but I think the thing is, there was nothing being discussed. It, it, I mean, we see a lot no, of guys. No, I, there was I, I nothing buy that. being discussed. So I, I'm, I'm going to give them, a, I, I will lax the rules a little bit because there's nothing of significance being discussed. There's no conversation going on between two players. There's no conversation between the coach addressing the team yep. or anything like that. Yep. So I don't have a problem with it. He just, you know. But I think the thing is, Skip, is that LeBron and AD and the other guys have come to accept this is who Dwight is. Okay. He's not going to be, Skip, he, uh, that, nope. that's, not, that's not what he is. He is fun-loving. Right. So you're going to have to accept him. By the him, way, I looked that. up last night. I think he's made $235 million in his career. So he's he's happy. He's, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's I doing mean, okay. He's laughing all the way to the $235 million? <laughs> are you kidding? So he's along for a great ride yeah. right now, and he should know that, and he should play to that yeah. and try to keep it inbounds, serious inbounds. As long as right? you keep on giving us those eight, eight points, you, eight rebounds, yeah. a couple of blocks a game, we good. Okay, so you got two X factors right now. Obviously, you lost Avery Bradley. Right. Can't get him back. That's, right. that's over and done. Right. You will miss him some. Yes. Three and D. Yes. Got that. Right. But Kuzma is an X factor because the other Great. day against well, he Orlando, got, he went crazy you, you went, nutty hot. Yes. Like he went twilight zone yes. hot as he can. Right. Sometimes he goes cold. Sometimes he plays really well, good. Well, Skip, if he, if he does that yeah. on a regular basis, it, we they won't lose a game. In the playoff. If he gives you, if he shoots like that, but we also got a little bit from Deion Wade. Do you see Deion Wade? I like Deion, but I've always liked him. And I believe you can call upon him and he will deliver in big yeah. moments. He will. Mm -hmm. But Dwight, you never know. Is he all in or not all in? And again, I don't think Dwight will take anything from any guff from LeBron. Like he, LeBron can't call out Dwight the way he might be able to call out some of the other backup kind of players. But Dwight knows this is as close, I mean, with the exception of the getting to the finals against Kobe. Yep. This is his probably his, sure. his last best chance. Well, he better know and, that. And, and, you know, look, there are a lot of people that didn't – I mean, think about it, Skip. Uh, Charlotte had him for, uh, for a cup of coffee, and they got rid of him. Yep. Uh, uh, and Memphis, like, you can you start talking to other teams if you want to. They didn't even want him. Mm. So he understands. Now, you've been on a lot of teams. I mean, you went from Orlando to, to Atlanta, you know, uh, uh, to L.A., to yep. Houston. So you've been six teams, Skip. No, I got it. So – I posted something the other day calling out Dwight. I said, nope, you're wrong, D D Dwight Sharp. It's Clippers in seven. I rescind that. I take it back. Oh. It's no, over. No, 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 no. That was about the time Lou went to Magic City. <laughs> yeah. It didn't take much. Yep. Download the all-new Fox Sports app now.